And how did you find out about the move and what went through your mind when you found out? Um, oh, yeah. Oh, sorry about that. Um, it was actually after I got done lifting in uh, Vegas. And, um, you know, Dave called me up and told me what was going on. And I got to say, you know, it is what it is. But um, I'm excited for the opportunity. I'm glad to be able to go out there and play and continue to play the game that I love. So um, I feel like I'm still a dominant nose tackle interior guy in this league and I'm just go out there and continue to prove it and show people. When you see a defense playing as well as this defense has, how can you elevate it and help them with the run defense which has been more of a challenge? Really just going out there and doing the best I can. Um, you know, stopping the run, plugging up holes and just allowing those guys to go out there and pass rush. They've been doing an amazing job before I got here so I don't think none of that's going to change. We saw someone like Jason Peters come in earlier this year, and he hadn't been with the team. Given mm -hmm. that you've been with the team, new playbook, but you've been conditioning and all of that, yeah. where is the transition? Well, not much. You know, um, I played last week. It's not like I've been off right. or just coming off the street. So um, my uh, condition is good. My health is good. I'm just ready to go out there and play. The only thing is I'm playing for the Dallas Cowboys. And, Speaking of, you know, that's weird, a big deal. How weird does it feel to have the Cowboys start on after spending some time with the Giants and trying to stop the Cowboys? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a little weird, but um, I'm, I'm excited for it. Um, a lot of my family, my uncle that live out here in Dallas is, is pumped. He, he couldn't believe it when I told him, so he had to call me back just to make sure. And I said, yeah, it's, what I told you is real. So, you know, everybody excited for me. Um, I'm excited myself. Um, the team is playing, playing well and just want to be able to come in and help out. Have you had a chance to talk to Dan Quinn since you got here, and what was that conversation? Um, it was it – was, Fairly simple. Um, he watched my film. He's, he knows what I can do. I know what I can do to go out there and help and contribute, and that's what I'm going to do. So there ain't really much to say or nothing lavish that's coming. You know, I'm just coming in here to stop the run and help this team win games. Um, I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of hard to say, you know. Um, I'm, I'm happy, you know what I mean? I ain't really got nothing else to say. Um, I wish those guys the best of luck. Um, you know, I spent five years there, and, um, you know, those guys are fighting. So right now I'm in a, a nicer position, I guess if you could say records-wise, but um, I still got to go out there and perform and uh, produce. It is a business, but at the same time, it's good to be wanted. Oh, no, no doubt. No doubt. When um, they told me who I was getting traded to, you know, I was pretty excited. I was, I was I ain't gonna lie, I was happy uh, to be with a, you know, a winning organization. You know, they got a lot of young guys that's out there playing tremendous ball. So for me to come in at this point in my career and for a team that won me, you know, I'm just <laughs> thank, thank the man above, you know what I mean? Can you play? You answered this, but what most excites you about playing for this season? Just, you know, uh, when we had Rob Marinelli, you know, he came from, you know, this tree and just playing the way that uh, we played when I was with Rod. Um, not to say that the scheme that we had in Las Vegas was different or bad. I just felt a little bit more comfortable in the scheme, being able to get upfield penetration calls and uh, disturbed plays. So um, I'm excited. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, I, I don't know. I'll just, I'll just say he called me the king. I ain't going to say nothing. I'll say that. Did you play this week? Sorry if they were to that. Yeah. Um, I think I can know enough to go out there and play and play at a high level. Um, she was only, what, what's today, Wednesday? So we got a few more days left. So I got some time, you know what I mean? The game ain't tomorrow. It's Sunday. So I'll be, I think I'll be just so, I'll be all right. When you think about stopping the run, facing a mobile quarterback this week, if you do play, how does that change the challenge of stopping the run? Well, now they got an extra uh, a run blocker since uh, the quarterback is going to be running, doing a good amount of, of that. But um, really just, you know, reading our keys, getting off the ball, being destructive, you know, just making it tough on them as best as we can and, uh, you know, pulling out another win.